Yo, what's poppin' everybody? It is your boy Christo back again with some more Monster Hunter World Iceborne now weapon lock. Today, we are getting started with Iceborne proper. We gotta go to the ancient forest to check out the Legiana traps. Alright, so... We're going into Mass Rank with nine weapons left. And I intend to hunt every single thing in... Every single thing, not just the required hunts like I have been doing, so... So, we'll see how far we get. Because I fully intend to reach and slay Fatalis. Guess I'll just have to... See if I can actually get that far. Feels a little weird now that the Elder Crossing investigation's done. Let's see. It's exciting too, though. I wonder what there should next. be some more tracks right here. It's so quiet. Let's see, if I remember what right, is? I've just got to keep running and grabbing these so tracks. Where are the birds? Maybe something's got them all spooked. I mean, that's a fair assumption, Those Handler. West, partner. What the hell's going on with my camera? Oh, well. Be super long this controller is a piece of junk. I've got to... One of these days, Maybe I'll get something better. Yeah. Is I think a mouse might be like... Once every ten years, right? Is that better? We can't really call our investigation complete if we don't stick around to see for ourselves. I suppose that's true. That wouldn't be... True to the scientific method of it all. Alright, and cutscene! <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm sorry about like how stuffy I sound. I am someone who gets very much like very bad pollen allergies around this time of year. There's Velcana. I forgot that they introduced her so early. Like, first cutscene. Monster Hunter World Iceborne. Alright. Believe you me, I am hella excited. Now that everyone's here, let us begin. We have a serious topic to discuss. As uh, yes, we do. Assembled the fleet masters, along with the first fleet field team members I've been able to reach. Now, I'm sure that you are all aware by now. Legiana have been leaving the new world in droves. Flying far out into the open sea. Director, please take it from here. Gladly, sir. First Gladly, sir. Uh -huh. Legiana are not known for long distance migration, nor for abandoning their primary habitat. Why they've begun crossing the ocean is an ecological mystery. Either something has begun to affect the biological nature of the Legiana, or they've been driven out by some change in their habitat, some anomaly that has stimulated them. To migrate beyond the sea. Beyond the sea. <laughs> Almost like the Elder Crossing. Commando? Just some deja vu. <clears throat> so, thoughts? Ha! Do you have a need to ask? I can tell by that fire in your eyes that your mind's already made up. It's not just you, Commander. 
I think we've all gotten tired of following the same old routine lately. Good. I hereby declare we focus all available resources on investigating this Legiana issue. Effective immediately. Oh, now we're talking. Commander, sir. We were thinking that if we follow the migrating Legiana, we should be able to discover somewhere to land. Like a new island, even. So, we go by ship. Or, better yet. Something a little more stimulating. Air travel's our specialty, after all. Yes. The Third Fleet's airship would allow us to spot the best landing area and help us get an idea of the surroundings. That settles it, then. I'll be choosing who to dispatch. But I need you to stay and watch over everyone here. I'll need hands from the... All right, Matt Mercer is staying behind. We'll need your help to set up a forward operating base. And you two... I can't believe that Matt is Ganondorf in, uh... Once your preparations in the new, uh, Legend of Zelda game. <clears throat> Oh, excuse me. We may not know what lies out there, but that's no reason to falter. Just like the star-guided youth of legend, we must always press on. Good luck, everyone, and may the sapphire star light your way. All right, then. Dismissed. All right. Master rank has been unlocked. Oh, a boy. Alright, speak to the commander. Alright. It's nearly time. Once you're ready, there's no telling what well, you'll find out there. Another <laughs> new frontier. Alright. Well, Let's okay. do this. We have an airship to catch. This is a complete tangent, but I have always loved airships in this kind of Yo, media like your partner's already prepping. she's with the fleet master like airships have always been just some really neat to me so it's nice to see that they're a pretty consistent thing in monster hunter you're certain yes the clouds were headed in the same direction as the legiana the wind was blowing toward the northwest that day so <sighs> hey prepared Just like the fifth banner, luck's on our side. Yeah, I can't wait to get started. Yo, what's your hair doing? <laughs> Whoa. Weird physics. Hey. Legiana, huh? And we have no idea where they're going? Heard some kind of rumor about an island. Yeah? That'd be pretty exciting, huh? <laughs> Look! An island? The currents are getting worse. Hold on tight. Yeah. Ah, plots. The plot stone. Partner. I'm all right. But more importantly, look, an island. Wait. That is no island. You're right. It's a land mass. It's too dangerous to continue. But we're almost there. We must regroup. You two inside. Let's go. Lead the way. We'll find a place for the ship to uh, Excuse me, I just had to go through a bit of a sneezing fit. But yeah, awesome cutscene. We're we're taking on this new frontier solo. See you later. Oh wow!
a rocky landing in the Horfrost Reach. I always love snow, like, icy areas like this because, like, I've lived in the south my entire life and, like, we never get this kind of snow. So it's always been, like, kind of really, really neat to me to see. Like, knee-high snow is like a... is like a fantasy. Alright, the direwolf layered armor. It's like the direwolf layered armor is honestly like some of my favorite the series has had. But it's still so cold. This place is something else. Let's start looking for a good spot to land the airship. Alright. Let me just double check just to see if there is anything in the, the ground's in the box. Here. No? Alright. You good? All right, we got some hot peppers. We can make a hot drink out of these peppers to beat the cold. Yep. Fresh new area. <clears throat> All right, just forced me to focus on the handler. I'm gonna grab some crystal bursts. Got some more Legiana. And some Beotodus. If if my camera would would work with me. Um, is this some more hot peppers? Yes, I'll grab some more just to have some more. Alright, and the introduction of potentially the best Piscean Wyvern in the series. Ah, there it is. Eating the the half frozen popo corpse. Okay. Dude, she's actually leaving for once. There he is. The snow shark. Oh, I did not eat. Um, you know what? I'm going to Vitality Mantle. Handler, you're, you're not really helping. 
I'll be completely honest with you. One, two. That did not work. You're immune to KO while you still have stuff on your head. Let's see. Alright, mantle's gotta come off. I have mega potions at the ready. Okay. Okay. Let's see if we can get a mount, maybe? That'll get out of the snow, at least. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, at least remove some of the snow, which is good. There's that mount. Will you shut up, Handler? You're, you are not helping. I'm playing the bonk stick. Let me bonk it. Oh my god, stupid horn. There we go. A lot of good damage on that head. Probably close to a KO as well. I'm out of stamina. Some more bonk time. Damn it. Let's just boom, boom, boom. There's the horn break. Alright, Bayo, what are you oh you're recovering yourself. I forgot that I forgot the monsters do this. So they recover themselves in and that kind of stuff. <clears throat> okay, let me back up and heal. Oh, are you leaving? Yes, in that case, I'm going to go back to camp and eat real quick. Alright, we're back, and, and now we're really ready to take down this fish. El fish. Boom, boom. Make a grapple. Yeah. Oh! Cat coming in with the save. How about you go into this wall? Okay, that wall didn't count apparently. Ooh, Bumbero! This is just the same turf war as like the Juriototus bear off, but it's still cool. Especially with how much bigger Bonbaro is than bear off. Alright, Bonbaro, I'm just gonna. Barbara, I don't want to fight. I'm just going to let you be. Alright. 
shouldn't be. I don't feel like there should be much more left to you. Handler, I do not care. I'll be. Let me be 200% with you. I do not care. Boom. Let's see if we can get a KO. There we go. Not a KO, but... Oh my fucking god. This stupid broken horn. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. At least we got that to make up for it. <clears throat> Shut up. One. Boom. 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 Shut up, you stupid fish. Yeah, it's only out of the snow for so long, like, if you do actually want to break those, those, uh, fins, you only, you only have so much time to do it. Oh, I thought it was leaving. I was gonna, I was gonna grab some more stuff, but no, it's just wandered off just to, just to avoid me, I guess, which is fair. Shut up. Shut up. Go into the wall. There we go. You actually hit one this time. Boom, 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 boom. Golf swing. Two, three. Damn it. Cold can really cut into your stamina. Time. Matt Mercer, what are you doing here? I mean, thank you for telling me that, that my hot drink wore off, but... But what are you doing here? <laughs> You're supposed to be back in, uh... In Astera. Which is surprising. Let me go ahead and sharpen up. Have my vitality ready. Oh, the stupid, the stupid camera is really getting to me today. I don't know why. Go, there's something broken. Damn it, that hurt. I love how it like makes like like snowblower sounds and that kind of stuff. It's really cool. Like it sounds like an engine. Take a shot every time Handler says that. Jeez. Like, yes, I will break it as soon as it, like, comes out of the snow. You know what? Sure. Handler, if you'll just shut up about it, I will, I will attack these leg things.
Will it make you happy, Handler, if I do this? There we go. Leg fins are broken. Are you happy now? Now can I get back to bonking? Oh, you're almost dead. Well, let me grab this piercing pod and this material. Now I'm gonna go on and put on a Gilly, just so I can make sure it doesn't see me. Just make triple sure you can never be too safe. Head is retenderized. One. Damn it. One of these days. I will run. Oh! There we go. It's dead. What do you got for him, Bear? Let's see. We got a Bear Totus Cortex. Beatotus Grand Fin and a Beatotus Grand Fin. Let's go to the new base. Let's see, in total we got two Hardhorns, four Shards, and three Grand Fins. No money, but no faints either. Got a couple achievements. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is the perfect open area to set up camp. This looks like the perfect place to land. Legiana, they're here? <laughs> yes, we found their tracks. There's no mistaking it. Hmm. We'll need to ramp up this investigation. For now, let's get our base camp up and running. Assemble at the council table. We need to talk things over. Yes, sir. Exciting. Excuse Let me, me. Thank you again for the good work you did on reconnaissance. The location you found was perfect. You two really did a fine job. Now that we've laid the groundwork, we also the commander with that giant coat over his shoulders is such a cool, such a cool design. I've already made an urgent requisition to Astera for construction materials. The transport is prepared to sail here in a few days' time. But of course, this is uncharted territory, and there's no guarantee that the transport will be able to find safe passage after they land. The landing point is quite a distance from the forward operating base, so I'd like for you to investigate the surrounding area. <laughs> forward operating base and surrounding area. Now, 
lacks a bit of punch when I put it like that. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's see. How about we call this base Celiana? And the surrounding area can be called the Horfrost Reach. Celiana? That's a wonderful name, Commander. Now then, I want you to conduct an expedition. Yeah, whatever you say, Commander. Reach and ensure that the area is safe for passage. I trust you to respond sensibly to any threats you may find out there. Take this as a good opportunity to get a lay of the land, too. Don't let your guard down. And don't forget your cold weather gear. Good luck out there. All right. Our well. first priorities are setting up base and securing that supply route. Well, we're going to do all that next time. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, you all know what to do. Have yourselves a damn good one. Later.